fight and Robert just kicked him in the face. Okay, being that's it, Robert, let's go. Oh, oh damn. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh big as ass, Robert. What's good, people? It's your boy. Today, guys, we're back with another CJ the Champ reaction. Stink meter, the personification of hatred. Okay, now. This is a trip down memory lane, man. You know what I'm saying? We all know Sting Mender, man. We all know what he's about. But let's see what CJ got to say about him, man. Oh, my God. Boondock still to this day one of the greatest shows of all time. Easily. Not many things topping that shit, bro. I'm going to keep it a butt. Not many things topping that. So I can't wait to see this. Uh, we're going to see what CJ's talking about. Yeah. We're going to dive on in. All right, guys. We're going to uh, be up here with this format. We're going to try this one out. Uh, some people will say that I should have more of the reaction video up instead of my uh, face cam. So we're going to try this. <clears throat> Hatred. Oh, I was to dislike a nigga intensely or oh, passionate. I was finna skip through because I don't be wanting to spoil myself. You know what I'm saying? Usually he has a little like thing in, in his what's called to the point where you completely detest and despise that nigga on a daily basis. Yes, yes, indeed. Now, you see, yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed there brother, many haters in fiction, just in general. For an example, Reverse Flash. Mm, I mean, yo, yeah, Barry so much. Yes, I don't even know if it was me, Barry. It was like a severe case of. Meat munching, hell, <laughs> eating. Then obviously, you know, we got your DOs, your freezers, your flat nose, yes, no indeed. nostril. Yep. Uh -huh. Lord, how does that yes. nice smell? And yo, you even got your scars. Oh, Scar, please help me. <laughs> oh, long live the king. Hell, nah. <laughs> the ultimate man that we are focusing on today. Might be one of the most despicable, vile, disgusting, and ignorant human beings to ever grace God's green earth. The personification of hatred, Colonel H. Con Colonel, Colonel, that that nigga name, Colonel. That's crazy. Okay, CJ. Hey, 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 hey. It's like it's been a minute since we had to see that, bro. It's been a minute. It's holidays and stuff, though, so you know what I'm saying. Exhibit A. I talked to me. For the warnings, I mean, like, we have understand seen the philosophy of Boondocks, Stinky, bro, come on. And basically, this entire video. Ladies and gentlemen, I must explain to you the nigga moment. An the altercation nigga moment. caused by ignorance, overwhelming the logic, otherwise rational thinking of a brother. Now, Y'all ever been in a nigga moment, man? Y'all ever been in a nigga moment, man? Be honest. I feel like I've been there, but I haven't really, like, took it that far type, you know? Watch closely as I personally... Like, I feel like I'm a bigger a person if I just, like, remove myself from all that. Ooh. You ever had a nigga hey, do that to you, bro? You, you want hey, 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 what you say to me, cuh? Now, as you can see, these niggas is ready to pop a cap in each other's asses. Yes, I see. They start to get to blasting and miss every single miss shot. Miss every like goddamn bullet. Off the set of A New Hope. And once they realize <laughs> they just both wasted each other's time, they end up figuring out that they just wasted their life away. Freeze! Yeah, yep. That's tough! That's tough. Them niggas said freeze and then now, just shot the ass. That's tough. Understanding of what is happening here. But Ladies also facts. Gentlemen, meet Colonel H. Stinkmeter. Now, mm -hmm. even back in his childhood, Stinkmeter was always Oh, old, nah, big head ass, ass boy. Damn, he that nigga. Hold on, bro. Real quick. That nigga, uh, eyebrow looking crazy, bro. How it goes straight up? How eyebrow goes straight up like that? old, hating, bitter ass. He didn't care for beautiful sceneries, sunsets, rainbows. He just disliked happiness in general. Man, this some old bush. At age 15, Stinkmeter lost his eyesight to cancer. Damn. But the thing Got is, you. he didn't care. He was just glad that he ain't have to see shit no more. So oh. doctors only gave him three years left to live. So oh. he decided for those three years, he would dedicate his life to spread misery and hatred. I haven't seen either so long. Singles. And the thing is, people don't even know how he lived to become an old man. All they just say is, bro, is basically a Sith Lord. The hatred drove him to live every single day. That's later, crazy, bro. Beat up ass but to fight death, he's, he's, he's hating. He's a hater too much. Atlanta, he's a fight death. Like giving a care in the world, Jesus oh my Christ. Goodness. It's like truck who done possessed this man. <laughs> Now, thinking about it, who oh. in the hell gave this old blonde nigga a driver's license? Whoever mm. issued this sh you should be ashamed yeah. of yourself. Yeah, y'all tweaking, gang. This man is speeding through a parking lot going oh at least God. 50, and he starts bagging in the gray ass car. And he's like, hmm, there better not be nobody in my parking space. This is handicapped. You know, this man <laughs> gets out of his car, and he's like, who in the hell parked in my space? That's like calling 1-800-collecting ass whooping. Oh, right, no, no the nigga spit in it. Yo, bro, are you blind? Yes, I am. You got a problem <laughs> with that, nigga? 
And ladies and gentlemen, just like uh, that, he does that Robert perfectly. Freeman. Yeah, so he we says, yo, you could have killed somebody. And this man stink me and are like, well, I'll be doing them a favor. Getting ran over by me is as gracious as Jesus Christ coming down himself and giving you holy communion. Oh my goodness. Oh, look what you did to my car. Brother, you best have insurance. Nigga, you better have insurance. <laughs> Ass whooping insurance, cause you about to pay a deductible. Now, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> granddad can even Hell do no. things right now. He could do A, walk away. Walk away. Yes. That was me. Or B, I just or walk away. Crazy blind man. I ain't and finding no old crazy nigga. He got it. Chose B. So stink meter just start. I'm not finding that man. Spitting in his face. He like, what you gonna do, huh? Puck that ass, ass, ego, man. That ego, ass, that pride. Ass, puck ass, bitch ass, nigga. You gonna do something about it, bitch ass, nigga. And then stink meter <laughs> ends up doing. One of the most evil, demonic the he does, bro, I forgot. you can ever do to another man. Hold up. I smell new shoes. This oh. man steps on oh. new white oh. Oh, oh, hell no. Nah, bro. This is the most disrespectful thing you can he ever do. Been, to he's a bad bounce, bro, though. He's tripping. I just bought these hoes from Foot Locker like five minutes ago. And nah, nah. If you replay it back. Brand new shoes, man. Bro, pulled back his whole leg. Had that hoe at a 90 degree angle. Now that hoe hurt, too. Yeah. That hoe hurt. Oh, my God, yeah. Nah, bro. That's how you know he ain't got no respect for you. That hoe hurt, too. Yeah. And it's his shoes. Yeah. Anybody. Yeah, God. So then, this was the final straw that made Granddad tick. So Granddad swung <laughs> at him, but we dodges him. Weave? Oh, my God. Uh, yeah. Oh, Knee. Oh, Lord. Yikes. And it was on his bad knee. Jesus Christ, my brother. You just got your ass. Yeah, you got that. I ain't gonna lie. How? how so Huey how? had to stop him. He was like, nah, bro. This Ooh. over. So later on, after Granddad was just fully embarrassed, everybody just started making fun of him. Riley was like, hey, could it be me getting my ass whooped by an old blind guy? And later that night, while Granddad cleaning his shoes, bro, look on the news, and he like, it's just yeah. a fight. Nigga on the news. Oh my god, that's so sad. <laughs> and it wasn't just local news. CNN was reporting on it and international news. Brother got niggas in Mexico City calling him a piñata. <laughs> and guess who left a voicemail? Oh my god, he's a demon. He's Hello, a demon. Robert. Pick up the phone, pick up the phone. Now I saw you get your ass beat by that old blind nigga on the news. Oh. And I know you must be feeling embarrassed right now. So you know what would cheer you up, Robert? Some KFC. Kentucky Fried Chicken. Robert, hello? Don't you walk <laughs> it got so <laughs> Later on, Granddad ended up going back to the mall, found Stink Meaner, and challenged him to a fight. So Granddad <laughs> started training thinking he Ali or something, because Huey was like, Granddad, you don't know what you're doing. This man is like a blind samurai or something. I had a dream about him the other night. He's like that. And then on the other side, you got Riley ignorant ass promoting this like promoting like was Jake Paul versus Andrew Tate or something. So now it's the night of the fight and it is packed. Riley out here overcharging for ten dollars. So they start squaring up and stink me and are like, Yeah, you scared? You scared? Ain't you literally you get bitch, nigga. Yeah, I can smell the right off of you. <laughs> That's vintage. So he starts swinging, and then Huey ends up realizing, oh, my God, this ain't no trained blind samurai. He's just a blind nigga, bro. You literally get nothing from beating up a blind dude, bro. Like, getting revenge on a blind dude, what do you get, bro? What do you get? You don't get redemption or nothing. You're just in a lose-lose situation. Yeah, if you were talking about you on the news, bro, that's going to pass, bro. He ain't got it's not, but it is, bro. Nothing. He was just a blind old man that just got lucky. So he was like, wait, hold on, Granddad. But it was too late. Finish him. Finish him. <laughs> Being the fuck out of that nigga. <laughs> and started kicking up like Raw Rang. And then Granddad loaded it. <laughs> like Raw Rang? <laughs> oh, oh, my God. God. Now niggas think you're an asshole. did it just knock him out. Granddad killed him. <laughs> All because he got trapped in a nigga moment. Nah, that's yeah, so that crazy. Was exhibit A, and it's time to move on to <laughs> Exhibit B. Oh my God, this is this this is I one of the best it. episodes ever. I now present to you. This is exhibit one of the best B, episodes. The episode. return. <laughs> so as we know, Stink Meaner died, but little did we know, this was just the beginning. This man is in hell, training with the devil. Bro is washing demons, and even the devil <laughs> said, "He's the baddest motherfucker." Butter. Butter. <laughs> this man got the devil to acknowledge that he is the baddest 
Africa he's ever seen. That is the most legendary feat of all time. He even called the devil a bitch ass nigga. <laughs> the devil's like, Colonel H. Stink Meter, I am now sending you back to spread ignorance and hatred in the black community. Ah, hell ain't shit. That's so crazy, I'm man. For you, Freeman. <laughs> so nah, Tom, I can't tell if it's a voiceover or if it's the actual show. He's, he's so good at doing the voices. Even Stink Meaner knew that everybody. What do you say about? What do you say? What do you say about Tom? So meanwhile, we cut over to Tom, who is basically the equivalent of a brother that is out of touch with his people. Yeah. But even Stink Meaner knew that every Fact. brother's spirit is weakened during that moment. Oh my so goodness. this dude ends up cutting off Tom and taking his parking spot. So Tom's like, Hey, hey, come on, <laughs> not the Uzi. Hey, hey, come back here. I had my turn signal on and everything. But then the dude turned around and just start cussing him out. He like, F you punk ass, pussy ass, weak ass, nigga. I'll beat your mother to the ditty ass, nigga. Don't ever your life ever holler at me, nigga. Now, as we can see, Tom. Bro, is that a voiceover? Is that CJ, bro? I can't tell, bro. I can't tell. I can see CJ doing his voice. He's been trapped in a <laughs> moment. And this was oh my God. time for Stink Meaner to make his move. I remember, bro. I remember. Oh my God! Oh, this freeze frame's crazy. I remember, man. Niggas was just putting a voice over that of this clip over everything, bro. This was so funny, bro. Back in the day, who remembers that, shit, bro? Oh my God! Take me back. Oh, that is impossible, bro. Oh yeah. <laughs> You was talking about that good shit a second ago, and you got kicked in your chest. Oh, chest. You eat a dick, nigga. You, you eat a dick. <laughs> nah, bro. How do you do a standing, like, how do you jump straight up in the air and then do a fucking die kick? It's impossible. Oh, sorry. Oh, so, so, somebody call an ambulance. Hey, help. Now, ladies yeah, that's and gentlemen, CJ. CJ's doing the voice Tom of the dog. This is crazy. He's so Stink good, bro. <laughs> so this man, Stinkman, got him acting Of all people, bro. Tom, bro. You got said, Tom. Yo, Courtney, you got Tom. Then later on, bro goes home oh to my God. Tom's yeah. wife. And, and he's like, yeah. oh, yeah, I want to beat up them booty cheeks. <laughs> Oh, Tom, what has gotten into you? <laughs> nah, this ain't nah. thing that's about to get into you. And he beats his wife. Jeez. <laughs> oh, w oh is. Imagine an <laughs> evil spirit taking over your body and using your body to yeah, nah. beat up on your girl Doonies. Nah. Yeah, nah, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I don't know how, but there's, I, I won't find a way to get to that man. I don't care if he's a spirit or whatever the fuck. I'm gonna find a way. There's gonna be some way. There gotta be some way, right? There gotta be something. Nah, bro, that's crazy. So then later on, Stink Meter pulls up to Robert's house. Sneaking, now, wait, I what? don't know what Robert <laughs> looking up on the toilet, but the sensor bar is going crazy right Hello? now. Hello? The dog starts tearing the door down. Oh, with yeah, that's what I didn't think it was definitely naked. Like, I remember. I'm back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, yo, what in the shining is going on right now? The so Johnny? The man start running down the steps. Jesus Christ, this man's hope. Package is hanging out. So Stinkman <laughs> is saying, you don't remember me? You don't remember my name? <laughs> oh my What's goodness. What's my name, nigga? Jesus What's Christ. What's my name, Robert? What's my name? <laughs> and finally says his name. He's like, ding, ding, ding. That's right, nigga. Oh my and goodness. And then all the Freemans get ready to jump him. So they get the oh my God, yeah. They, they was driving his head, but he's going crazy. Wait, uh, oh my God. <laughs> And he is still continuing. Jesus Christ. Nigga got the whip. That man do nothing. Oh, my God. Oh. Boy, is that all y'all got? Yeah. Look at his backhand again. Oh, my God. That man, he was buzzing so out every single martial arts move in his butt. Oh, my God. Smack this man with, like, three faces to finally just knock him out. Nah, that's crazy. So later on, they got him restrained on this guy. Guy strapped the niggas down, man. Pause. Date. So in the middle of his date, Stink me to wake up and he like, Robert, I know you hear me, you bitch. I know you <laughs> How you have a date over here? What's called? Oh, 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 no, no, and you got a oh, oh, crazy no. psychotic maniac upstairs. Robert, I know you didn't vote this year, you lousy nigga. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, hold on, baby. That's just a TV. So they end up having to call the Catholic Church to exorcise this man. So there was only one man that could save the day. May God bless you, Robert. I came as fast as I could. So 
Now let's go ahead and get down to business. Oh Removing the evil spirit bro. from a brother is as hard as getting rid of a hunk of shit. So we must use these holy weapons from they God himself. Ruckus, a bunch of weapons that I will not say because <laughs> dear God I will Yeah, they were crazy. Time. Yeah, yeah. A brother yeah. will make excuses. Yeah, they were, they were wild. Desperate, that brother may try to rap. That oh, brother may try to rap. You can hear it. Robert, I, I know you got bad credit. So they get up in the <laughs> room and Ruckus pulls out the Bible and says, Read, read nigga, read. Oh, and they start oh, beating oh. this man on the bed and saying something. Raises that. No, I'm gonna be honest with you. I know I'm not the most family friendly. <laughs> I ain't saying it. But then Huey ends up realizing this ain't doing nothing. So they kept on doing this for like oh several God. hours. And then they ended up figuring out that the only way to expel his this spirit dude? was to create peace with him. And the only way what to the do that was I for agree with that, to make him laugh about how much he hates brothers, and that finally ended up exercising his spirit and nah, sending him back down to hell. Exhibit <laughs> C. Oh, uh, did right here? Oh my right, god! Pure and anime inspiration right here. Exhibit C. The hateocracy. The hateocracy. So even though yeah. the stink meaner is now long dead and gone, he still had a crew. That wanted to come back and get it back in blood. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Dude the haters. Die, bro. A group of bitter old hating ass niggas consisting of Colonel H. Stick, Lord Rufus Crabmeister, Crabmeister is crazy. The Great Nasty, and Mr. George Pistofferson. Pistofferson is crazy, dog. Hold on, what was Shawnee's name? What was Shawnee's name? Mr. George Pistofferson, Lady uh. Esmeralda. Lady Esmeralda Grip, what? Girl, the Great Nasty. Great Nasty is crazy. Pistofferson. Now you see, they all met at a retirement home and they all hated each other. But the thing they had in common was that they hated everybody else even more. So oh they decided goodness. to cause complete- Look at them, man. Retirement home. Rolling down in the wheelchairs. And crashing bingo parties. B4, B4. Bingo, oh my nigga. God. Now what the f I win. Give me that shit. This nigga is blind, bro. How are you doing this? They had to kick him out. But that didn't stop him because they roamed the earth for a decade causing chaos. Oh Eventually, till they Why would you up. let these because lunatics out? Meter, the hateocracy reunited to get it back in blood. So meanwhile, we cut over to Ruckus working at this gas station and this black car pulls up. So they come up to the door and Ruckus is like, oh, hell no. Nah. What the hell y'all want? <laughs> you looking for someone. Are you sure it's someone or something? Because you should be looking for the zoo. What y'all looking for? The Curious George exhibit? We looking for a man named Robert Freeman. Oh, hell no. Y'all know Robert? Y'all best get to stepping before I send y'all ass to hell on. So you telling me you know Robert then? Good. Looks like I can find where he is if I beat your fat googly one-eyed ass to death. Oh my Whip goodness. his ass, Rufus. They on P too, bro. They broken. Like, that nigga Breaking busted, news. bro. Man at a gas station was jumped by three assailants in black. The victim, Mr. Uncle Ruckus, no relation, had this to say. No relation. Oh, Lord, that, that, that was three of them. Oh, they, they must have escaped from the zoo or something. Them damn wild animals. Police oh, my say goodness. <laughs> still at large. So, yeah, man. Uh, Ruckus got jumped. So later that day, George and Esmeralda pull up to Huey and Riley's school, uh -oh. and they like, I guess to the school, bro. Put them to the jail, bro. Yeah, Arrest right. these we people. Get check out, fool. So Huey end up realizing, obviously, something ain't right. So they go outside, and there they are. Well, 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 we came a long way to kill y'all little motherfuckers. <laughs> Dude, look at this jump. Uh -oh. Bro, how no, are they no, doing no, this, If bro. I see a pair of 75-year-olds moving like this, I already know I'm about to get my ass. Bro, they were busted, bro, like... I'm talking like Steven had to train in hell with the devil type shit to get some crazy kung fu shit. They just built like that, bro. <laughs> they start to get the scrap. Look at this. Oh, How are they moving like this, man? Oh my god, yep. 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 Oh, and uh, fun fact. She yep. hit this man with the exact combo that Orochimaru hit yep. Sasuke with. Uh -huh. But she hit him with that gripe nasty variant. So the he gripe nasty variant? Absolutely body oh my god, god bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. She hit it, she hit it Riley with the Neji joint. Riley just got absolutely body killed. Don't, 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 don't. Ran, bro. Hey, at least Huey put up a fight. Yeah, but they Riley ain't about that. He's not about to fight, bro. Hands, bro. But meanwhile, while this was happening, Robert ends up going fishing, but he oh, ends up no. running into Rufus. So he's like, come on, and how are you doing? Oh, nothing much. I'm just thinking about catching fish. I might catch one more today. Tell me, sir. You know a man by 
stink meter. Oh, uh, yeah, I would have I would got him out of there. Should, because you killed him. Robert Freeman! Oh. So Bruce starts swinging this. Oh, my goodness. What like, what is, is that? Robert's what the hell? But nah, it's been so Oh, my God. Thing, but Robert kicks the bell. Oh, W plays. W plays. Run. Run. Hiring <laughs> Bushido Brown to be a body. Bushido Brown. So he ain't up pulling up to the Run. house. So they start getting ready to this jump this train. Bushido Brown. But he low-key start working him. Oh, my God. This Look how he beat though, our man. girl. Beat the wig off oh that bitch. Oh, my God. Then he went, boom. Damn! Then he hit him with the finish! Ah! <laughs> but I say was because uh that nigga's life was past tense. Bro, this car that man lacking. Oh my god. Man. You gotta censor a lot of stuff now on YouTube because uh, you that new policy. You don't wanna make Mama Susan mad now, do you? <laughs> so granddad policy, yeah. He's like, okay, bro, listen, listen. I'm sorry I killed Steak Meaner. I am sorry I had a nigga moment. But then they end up saying, we don't give a about no stink meaner. <laughs> I beg your pardon. Yo, no, Ty Thomas, you killed her. It don't matter. We just came to f shit up. What? What? No. No, oh, bro. This whole time you thought, oh, crazy. they coming back to get it back in blood. No. <laughs> they literally came and did all this. All for sh and giggles. No, nah, this is crazy. That's just bro, kill them. Shoot them, so bro. No cap. Them, shoot them, bro. The cops came yes, shoot them, them, bro. Okay, right. Stink so, meaner right, saga. Right. Finally, nah, bro, I ain't gonna lie. I, I don't care, but they gotta, they, 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 prison, pr prison's fine. They shouldn't die. They shouldn't die. You shouldn't shoot them. It will look bad. But you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they, they, they get them life, bro. Don't let them get up out of there. Psych! Exhibit D. What? There's another one? I thought it was done. I know nothing Ladies about and this. Gentlemen. I know Welcome nothing about this. To this uncharted is un territory. What? Uncharted the territory. territory where legends are made. <gasps> Welcome. What to the? Exhibit D. What the? I now present to you the clone. So ah! Steak Meaner wasn't going to mess dead. with Robert. I thought he was Because done. he had a clone. You see, Steak Meaner answered the ad on uh, blackpeoplemeet.com. And the what? government made a clone of him. So what this the? is no clone <laughs> the of Steak Meaner. And it says, dear clone me. Go f with that nigga Robert. From OG Steak. What? Oh, and Robert is at the mall and he's. Why would they make a clone of a. Of a <laughs> Why would they make a clone of a, of a blind black man? An old black man? Like, what the. <laughs> they ain't tripping, bro. The back of his car is rammed oh, into goodness. again. And guess no. who did it? No. What's good, Robert? Oh, guess my God. What? I ran into your car and I didn't even want to park there. I just wanted to. Up your car and wait here to tell you about it. Am I recording and everything again? No. Nah, bro, but not again. I having this today. I'm gonna <laughs> kill you again, then, huh? What? No. This, this is not how you saw this. <laughs> and he's like, oh, yeah, the government gave me some augmentation. Oh, my Look God. He ain't see, bro. Oh, no my call? goodness. I kick boom. And people recording Robert getting oh, body. Robert, you got So, so you know bad. this episode was made back then during the glory days of World Star. So the cops ended up <laughs> coming and stopping this fight. But no, no, it wasn't over. Because later on, he get this call on Skype. <laughs> Skype. Skype. Skype, man. Matter of fact, does anybody even still use Skype? But anyways, no. Steak being on the phone and he like, What's good, Gilgo? Just to let you know, we gonna have a rematch. And I done already told the whole world about it. So if you don't show, you a bitch. <laughs> what the? <laughs> so they ended up having nah, another altercation, but Robert called the cops and they ended up arresting Thank you, Steve yes. Man. But then, so that, this is where it just got crazy. So Ed Wunsler pulls up to Robert's house. What's like, hell? hey, I heard about your altercation with Stink Meaner, so uh, I bailed him out. And now we're going to have the a whole fight because I like money. So they no, end up making this asshole. a whole fight, a televised no, event bruh. with There's promotional no material way. and everything. But while Robert was training for this fight, something was happening to him. The dark side <laughs> was taking over. Ah. He was slowly becoming more like Stink Meaner. So oh it's the my night God. of the fight, and you can I obviously see the difference in him. Man's got the ball spot and everything. Bro became what he wanted to destroy. So they start to fight, and Robert just kicked him in the Okay, be that's it, Robert. Let's like, go. Oh, I see. You must have took some karate classes. Oh, oh damn. Yeah, bro, this wasn't even a fight. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, oh bit his ass, Robert. The that you have to think about, though, this isn't really Robert. All this is is just Robert under Stink Meaner's influence. He ended up becoming what he wanted to destroy.
an oh. old hating ass ass nigga. So here we ended up having to say, like, "Granddad, this ain't you. Stop, man." And you like, look at the whole <laughs> crowd, bro. It's just silent. And then this man Ed like, hmm, looks like this entire event was a flop. This is what? basically like an Austin McBroom creator class fight. A flop. It was only fun when your ass was getting beat, Robert. What right, the? This is a, that's a hated ass nigga. Yourselves. So then Robert told Stinkminer, if I let you live, will you stop messing with me? And Stinkminer like, I mean, sure. All you did was just have to ask. Wait. <laughs> 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 stopped all this hate if you just asked him? No, that's crazy. No, nah, this so is. Three <laughs> months later. And this man Stinkminer outside of his house still harassing him. Bro, what the fuck? You like you more stinkover. That's What's up, Robert? So Robert ah. come through the door, he's like, get off my property. Oh, and Steve me to say, oh, I'm on the sidewalk. And I'm going to be here for the rest of your life, Robert. See you tomorrow at <laughs> 7. Bro, no. He lives. He lives, bro. <laughs> if I did not know about that, I'd never seen that episode. Okay, wow, that's a treat. I, 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 I thought I was gonna see everything I saw before. It was just gonna be fun. That was something new. I love that. <laughs> he said, "Well, there they go. All you had to do was ask." <laughs> nah, that's funny as hell, man. What the heck? Hey, man, shout out to CJ again. As always, I've been bringing up bangers at the bangers at the bangers at the bangers. You feel me? Yeah. Happy New Year's, everybody. You know what I'm saying? You already know. This year we're gonna make it big, baby. We're gonna go crazy. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna do, it, guys. You guys enjoy today's video? Smash that like button. Comment down below what you guys think. And last but not least, subscribe to your boy and hit that bell because you're on the road to 50k, people. Spam me up. We do this weekly. Amen. Catch y'all later. I'm out. This is bye.